Who's going to go to jail? Donald, Ivanka, Donnie Jr., Eric? I mean, who's it? So let's find out what's going to happen. That's what this video is going to be about. I hope you like the video. And if you do like it, please do like it. If you haven't subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. And thank you very much for watching. Hi, I'm Mark, and this is my journey through tarot. Come on. So let's just see what the cards have to say about this. I mean, it looks like um, the, it's all starting to fold in on each other. And Eric started off with all these 500 pleas of uh, uh, pleading the Fifth Amendment. You know the others are going to file right in and do the same thing. And then it's all going to go to trial. But who's going to go to jail? So this is one of my favorite decks, Golden Tarot by Cat Black, who's an Australian uh, artist. And this is uh, all digital here. Um, I love this box. I mean, look how special it is. And, and it's easy to get the stuff out and use it. I mean, it's like a little uh, presentation. There's no fumbling at all. So, except when I use it. Now, the booklet is pretty good, too. It's, Cat Black has written this, it seems like, and so there's a good explanation in the front as to her concept for the artwork, which is amazing. It's usually, it's about from the 12 to the 1500s, which she uses in here, which is like cut and paste digital artwork. And then in the back, it talks about her, and uh, she's a webmaster, an author, an artist, and she also, she actually lives in uh, Western Australia uh, with her cat, Ellie, by the way. So, and I love uh, my uh, tarot reader, Ellie, uh, Dreams Down Under. So she'd be tickled to know this, I think. Uh, so anyway, let's look at the cards. Um, my other favorite uh, uh, reader, uh, Violetta, uses these cards exclusively. They're the only cards she'll use. So there you go. They're beautiful, though. And they're not hard to handle. They're a little slicky. And when they're new, they're very gilded on the edge. And then as you use them, of course, that starts wearing off, which is sad. But... Um, but they're beautiful, they're easy to read, they're right or white uh, iconography, and you can figure out what the card means without any uh, problem whatsoever. And I actually read that Cat Black, the artist, uh, got her first tarot cards when she was 15. So, you know, she's someone who designed it uh, with, uh, you know, practical knowledge uh, at hand, not just commissioned to do the art, I think. So, anyway, I love these. I hope this is interesting for some of you. Uh, to look at the different cards when I do this, and uh, it's a good way to mix them up. And uh, so there we go. We'll get this uh, game going here. Okay, so this is going to be um, those trumps. Um, I want to know if, jo if Junior is going to serve jail time. I want to know if Ivanka will do jail time, and I want to know if Trump will do jail time. And um, will the first lawsuit the Trump Organization loses be for financial missteps. So those are all the questions I want to address in this reading. But before we address any of them, let's just have a moment of meditation. Okay. So first question out of the rank, uh, will Don Jr serve jail time. Well, Don Jr. serve jail time. That's going to be just three cards. Don Jr. will he serve jail time? One, two, and three. Will Don Jr. serve jail time? Signifier card for that? Two of Wands, short-term plans. Interesting. Could there be a short sentence for him? Uh, the next card in that is a Ten of Coins, which is a uh, familial uh, value, okay? So uh, coins are value, and the Ten of Coins is like familial wealth, the generational wealth, generational value. It's interesting that this is in the middle of that. And then uh, the last card for Will Don Jr. serve jail times is so many things. Uh, wands are uh, actions, plans, and uh, so many things coming at you. So will John, Don Jr. serve jail time? It looks like there's some, uh, there could be a plan, a short-term plan for that. With, uh, will 
be the saving grace is the f generational corruption that's been involved in this. Uh, and then um, the fact that uh, will he serve jail time is all these issues coming at, uh, together at once. Now, will Ivanka serve jail time, actual jail time? Some people feel like she would flee the country before that uh, came to pass. She would sneak out and go somewhere else. So Ivanka, three cards. One, two, well, Ivanka, she's a criminal. I mean, it's, 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 those are her natural instincts. Well, they're the, at least at the very least, they're her learned instincts. The first card for Ivanka, Ivanka served jail time. Look at this, long-term plans. So a little bit more here than uh, we had for um, Junior. Next card, uh, King of Wands. Okay, so King of Plans. This king is a bit feminine looking in the face, as a matter of fact. And burning uh, plans are actions, fire, uh, forward movement and uh, wow I think this still represents her and then the final outcome for this is the Knight of Wands also plans a night of getting something done so will Ivanka serve jail time I think there's a long-term plan and you know this looks to you know this person is looking out over the ocean at a ship um, this kind of jibes with my thinking that she would uh, flee the country. Uh, the center of this is that, yeah, she is the absolute fire king of her plans, and she will uh, execute her plans to avoid that happening. And then the final outcome with this night of, of plans is that she will also uh, be the So everything, everything, everything in this uh, spread says to me, this is all Ivanka, and these are all her plans to keep herself out of trouble. Uh, she will escape if she has to. She will execute her plan with the authority of a king, and she will fight for her plan with the uh, ferocity of a knight. Wow. The Donald, will he serve jail time? Donald Trump himself. And again, just three cards for that. Donald Trump, will he serve jail time? Donald Trump, Donald Trump himself, will he serve jail time? One, two, Three. Will Trump, Donald Trump, serve jail time? Okay. Signify first card up. Look at all the issues that he has to deal with. Wands are, are plans, issues, forward movement. Look at all of that he has to deal with. Next card. Ah, Four of Swords, which is uh, staying down, don't get up. This person is sick in bed, and I wonder if that will be his the softening effect of his mental stability, uh, if that will be something he uses to avoid jail time. And then the final card. Look at that, the, the generational wealth, the familial value of uh, this corrupt uh, empire. So I think that he will find some way, if not to avoid jail time altogether, to get it softened for, for some sort of a illness or mental situation. The final uh, question is, will the first lawsuit the Trump organization loses be for financial missteps? Will the first, we're going to the Trump org now, Trump org. Okay, which is Trump, but Trump org will the first lawsuits be for financial missteps? Of course, it will be. Six cards one, two, three, four, five, and six. Will the first lawsuit they lose be for financial missteps? Okay, signify a card of that for this diet across. Four of Swords, okay, knowing when to stay down. Truth, justice, rules, and law, they will know when to stay down as a signifier. The challenge to that uh, is uh, being embattled and outside the borders. Okay, Nine of Wands. Wands, again, are plans, or actions moving forward. He is outside the walls of his empire. Will Trump Org, will the first financial loss be for... Miss financial missteps. The first lawsuit they lose be for financial missteps. The base of this reading then with the nine of coins is really being flush with all the value that you need to get a thing done. Interesting. The past of this reading is the tower. Okay, so there will be uh, some sort of a tower moment, a disruption, a time to rebuild uh, that uh, precedes any of this. And the sky of this, the hierophant. So the government is the one who's in charge of what's going on here. Okay. And then the final outcome the lovers, so some sort of a pairing. And this is the major arcana, okay? This is not like the two of cups, which can also represent lovers. This is the pay, uh, the major arcana of the lovers. So there will be some sort of a, um, a pairing that uh, 
But it doesn't tell me if the first lawsuit losses will be financial missteps. Let's do four more cards to just to that. Will the first losses for Trump or be about financial missteps? Let's see what these last four cards tell us. The self of that question. Page of Cups, this again, compassion. Wow. Cups are compassion and passion. The page is very weak. There's a surprise. The environment that that's in is the high priestess. The high priestess is all knowing. This is almost like the um, the, the 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 law. Okay, is is there with all of this knowing? The high priestess. The hopes and the fears. Magician um, having uh, the tools that you need to get a thing done. Final outcome. Queen of Swords, yeah, I think this is telling us that, yeah, this will be, um, Lady Justice uh, will come through, and I'm just going to say that, yes, it'll be financial losses for the first uh, lawsuit that Trump or loses. Well, I guess that's how things are going to work out. Who could it? Who could have told? So I hope you liked uh, all of that information, and let me know what you think about uh, what the card said. I'm Mark, My Journey Through Tarot. Tomorrow's another day. Stop by. We'll do it again. Ciao for now. One, two, three. You really make a big difference. Thank you.